And again, February is Black History Month. Today, we are introducing you to a professor who wants to get more black students comfortable with math. As CBS News Philadelphia reporter Madeline Wright shows us, he's using YouTube to reach the very youngest. 50 times 60. Akil Parker shares his passion for numbers as an adjunct math professor at Cheney University. While he enjoyed learning math as a student, he admits there were times he struggled. I know how it feels to like sit in the classroom and not understand what's going on and you know not understand what the teacher's talking about. Parker says over the years he's had so many students asking for help outside the classroom that he decided to create a company called All This Math. He runs a tutoring business, but he also posts videos on YouTube so students can get free math support. There's a lot going on in this equation. He's posted hundreds of videos on his channel, covering everything from long division to quadratic functions. I want to make it more normalized, you know, for people in the black community to like really embrace math and run toward it. I think that, you know, we kind of shy away from math. Um, a lot of us have had negative classroom experiences in, in math classes. Data shows many black students are struggling. According to standardized test results from the Pennsylvania Department of Education, last year in grades three through eight, only 13% of black or African American students were proficient or above in math. That's compared to 19% of Hispanic students, 48% of white students, and 67% of Asian students. James Earl Davis is an urban education professor at Temple University. He says the racial achievement gap in math and other subjects has persisted for decades, and there are many reasons, such as the resources that are available in schools, the quality of teaching and learning, um, issues around poverty, um, those gaps that you see, in some cases, they can be explained by income. Despite the challenges, Parker is teaching kids that math mastery is possible. He incorporates black history into his lessons to make the material more relatable. This is what we call a, uh, a solution that doesn't solve, like Dr. King said. 11-year-old twins Jonas and Shiloh Winkfield Pearson get virtual tutoring from the professor every two weeks and also watch his videos. The thing that I won't forget is when he used the cross-section math. He calls it the um, Malcolm X method because he turns it into an X. The twins' mom says Professor Parker has changed their lives. The boys' confidence in their math skills has grown. Now they're both interested in STEM careers. Shiloh wants to be a dentist. Jonas, a robotic surgeon. If we can carbon copy a kill, um, I think that, you know, there would be so many other black boys, um, especially, who would feel that math is a safe subject for them. Parker believes math is a skill everyone should have. He wrote this book to teach parents how to find math in everyday life, so in turn, they can show their kids how it applies to the real world. Mathematics is, in my opinion, the single greatest subject to teach people how to solve problems. Solve problems in our personal lives and in the community by multiplying the ways to success. At Cheney University, Madeline Wright, CBS News, Philadelphia. Stay with CBS Philadelphia throughout the month as we continue to celebrate black history.